Yo, y'all been asked for this video for like the longest and I finally got me a six ice chain so now I can give y'all this review like I've been wanting to. So with that being said, y'all know how we do it. Let's get right to it. Let's jump right to this video fam. Chill. What's good, Cam Crew? It's your homeboy, Cam Quarter Banks, and welcome back to the channel. Now, if this is your first time tuning into my channel and you are interested in streetwear, sneaker content, and menswear fashion, this is the spot for you to be. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button, notification bell, hit that like button, and drop a comment down below and let me know you're a part of the tribe. You did. All right, now today we are talking about a brand that y'all have been asking me for for the longest. Like, honestly, I've been wanting to do the video, but I haven't had the opportunity to get the chain but the homies at Six Ice actually reached out to me and they gave me a change, so I wanted to give y'all this review and I wanted to give y'all my full honest opinion about how I feel about the chain and just to let y'all know some ins and outs about the chain. All right, now before I move forward, I wanna say I apologize to everybody that was waiting on this video that was supposed to drop on Wednesday, actually. It was supposed to drop, but YouTube was having a problem uploading the video whatsoever and whatever, I guess it was bad scripting or whatever. So basically, I had to re-record this video so hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. Let's just, I just wanted to give y'all that insight detail so I was not being off of schedule. It just wouldn't upload. But moving forward, let's just get into this video, all right? All right, y'all, now first thing first, you all have this box. Just real simple. Like I told y'all before, I don't like too much of crazy branding that's too big or anything. This is just real simple. Say six ice on the front. You got a slide out drawer box. And it's real simple. You got another bag that's on the inside. And on top of that, you have your authenticity and lifetime guarantee. So this basically says like if you damage your chain in any type of way, scratches or whatever you may do to it, if it messes up, you will have an opportunity to send it back and you will get you a new chain. That's their guarantee, their promise to you. That's your lifetime guarantee. So keep this card, man. And it breaks down some more information on here for you. So just make sure y'all read that down below. If y'all wanna know, just drop a comment down below if y'all want me to y'all the information or matter of fact i just have that listed down below in the details area so y'all can check out what the lifetime guarantee actually says but now we got to this bag it's nothing too crazy it's a white bag says six ice on it but i like this bag i like how it props open you don't have to like go zip it open or anything like that real simple just pop it open but one thing that i do like about this bag is that they have the cloth on the inside so it'll make sure that your jewelry don't get damaged or anything so after you're done wearing it and everything like that you just put it right back on the inside of the bag and you'll make sure that your jewelry do not get damaged which is really smart whether you have a plated vermeil or solid gold chain or whatever it may be you want to make sure that you are storing it to keep it clean now for those that's asking like yo what's the best way to make sure that my jewelry is going to stay shiny is going to stay clean and everything like that the inside of the bag is the best detail right there or what you can do is basically grab a microfiber cloth and you could just rub it down and you should be good to go but if you want me to actually drop a video for y'all or let y'all know how you should actually do the cleaning then go ahead drop a comment down below and i'll make sure i get y'all set up all right y'all now we are getting to the meat of this video which is what everybody is looking for we have this chain right here now this is six ice 12 millimeter 14 karat white gold diamond prong cuban link chain now that's a lot to say all in one and it took a while for me to even say that just to break it down to y'all but i keep it plain and simple and break it down to y'all and let y'all know what this means real quick all right now just as an inside detail for those that want to know what type of chain this is this is not just your general plated chain no it's actually a vermeil chain so drop a thumbs up if you know what vermeil means vermeil is a higher quality of a chain that's actually given on top of that they have a wide variety of chains that you could choose from so i mean like the different levels of chains that you could choose from so you could get a regular plated chain a vermeil or you could get a solid piece and you actually will have like different levels to get in your chain. All right, but now to keep it a buck with you, I'm not gonna hold y'all or anything. This is pretty pricey when it comes to the chain price. So depending on what type of size you get, your vermeil chain will be pretty pricey. All right, y'all now back to the measurements of this chain. This is 12 millimeters wide and it's 16 inches long. So for anybody who wanna know like what the actual depth of this is, it's 16 inches long. For me, this is pretty much like a choker. So I'll show y'all what that look like in a minute. But at the same time, I know a lot of people wanna see how you actually clamp it on. A lot of people been asking me that before, how you open it and how you close it and how you latch it on. So let me show y'all how that look real quick, all right? All 
All right, y'all, so for those who wanna know, there's a little stub that's here on the end, like right there at the middle of the clasp. All you have to do is put your thumb at the bottom and pop it open so it opens up just like a door. And all you have to do is unlatch the male piece that's on here. Now, if you wanna clamp it back on, all you have to do is add it right back on the inside just like I showed y'all and then close the latch and then close it right back up and it clamps right on and you just put it right on your neck and you ain't gotta worry about it coming off at all. Now, y'all know that this channel is about style and fashion and everything, so I wouldn't even be talking about this if it didn't even have nothing to do with style. Now, if I'm being honest, this is the perfect time for you to get like a Cuban chain, a prong chain, simply because the trend right now for a lot of people in fashion, you could be in a variety of different styles, but to have a bigger, bulkier chain, that's actually a trend that's going on right now. So having something like this or thicker will actually be right on the trend of your style. Now, for those who may be questioning, the metal that's on here, the metal base that's on here is 925 sterling silver. So no, no copper, no brass, no tungsten, none of that. It'll be 925 sterling silver. So you actually have a great quality piece. It's covered with a nice base. And then on top of that, you will have a thicker layer of actual white gold that's on here. So for all those who's asking like, yo, is it real? Yeah, it is. Now it's not a solid piece that's straight through all white gold. But like I said, you will have your sterling silver. And then on top of there, you will have a thicker layer of white white gold that's on top of it. Now normally a choker piece like this isn't my style but I wanted to try something new and on top of that this thicker layer actually is pretty fire to me so I wanted to try it out. I will be putting this on to show you how this look in just a minute but I do want to give y'all like some pros and cons real quick all right. The presentation on here is absolutely fire like I like how it shines. It definitely does shine wherever you go. Now I'm not into something being like too super super big or anything like that so this is like the perfect size. I'm glad that they actually make a 12 millimeter instead of having like a super super thick one which they do have you can choose that if you like to but i actually like the 12 millimeter but like i said i'm actually going to show you all how a 12 millimeter looks on me and again i'm more of a athletic build now the only thing that i don't like when it comes to this chain the only thing that does get me is sometimes it can jam up a little bit it may get twisted up a little bit but all you got to do is just shake it up a little bit and then after that it will unravel and it'll go back to being just simple as that it's something Something that's really small but again this is something that's actually common for a smaller size chain but actually that's the only small issue that I actually have with this chain now again this is the perfect time for you to actually be wearing these chains to be getting them actually right now because not only is it trending but the springtime is right around the corner hell today we just hit 70 so seeing that spring is around the corner and the trend is actually moving at the same time I wouldn't wait if I was you I will actually go to the site right now go to six ice and go ahead and get you a chain like this this is fire my man all right y'all now let me show y'all how this actually look on my neck and let me get up out of here i know i held y'all for a while and i appreciate y'all watching the video drop those comments down below if y'all have any comments if y'all have any questions make sure y'all drop them comments down below make sure y'all give this video a thumbs up i appreciate all the love that y'all give drop those thumbs up make sure that y'all head to six ice to go ahead and get y'all pieces when y'all trying to get some fashionable pieces and with that being said i'm gonna get up out of here check out how i style this real quick Y'all be easy. I'll catch up with y'all next time. I'm your homeboy, Cam Quarterbanks. I'm out. I'm gone. I'll holla at y'all. Peace.